Today I will make a comparison between four types of thyroid carcinoma. Feature number one is frequency which means how does cancer spread and grow in thyroid gland? In papillary carcinoma minus 75 to 80 percent. In follicular carcinoma, 10 to 20 percent. In medullary carcinoma, 5 percent. In anaplastic carcinoma, 5 percent. Feature number two is age which means who can be affected by this disease. In papillary carcinoma all ages. In follicular carcinoma, middle to old age. In medullary carcinoma, middle to old age but familial too. In anaplastic carcinoma, old age. Feature number three is female slash male ratio. Which means who can be more affected by this disease. In papillary carcinoma 3 to 1. In follicular carcinoma, 2,5 to 1. In medullary carcinoma 1 to 1. In anaplastic carcinoma, 1,5 to 1. So females can be more affected by the most of thyroid cancers than males. Feature number 4 is relation to radiation. Which means radiation exposure is a proven risk factor for thyroid cancer. In papillary carcinoma maximum radiation exposure. In follicular carcinoma, present radiation exposure but not maximum. In medullary carcinoma none. In anaplastic carcinoma, present radiation exposure but not maximum. Feature number 5 is genetic alterations. Which mean thyroid cancer is a genetically simple disease with a relatively low number of mutations in each tumor. In papillary carcinoma, red gene overexpression, and TRK gene rearrangement. In follicular carcinoma, RAS mutation, PAX per gamma 1 fusion. In medullary carcinoma, RET point mutation. In anaplastic carcinoma, P53 loss, beta catenin mutation. Feature number 6 is cell of origin. Which means where did this disease come from? In papillary carcinoma, follicular carcinoma and anaplastic carcinoma come from follicular cells. Except in medullary carcinoma comes from parafollicular cells. Feature number 7 is gross appearance. Which means the appearance of the thyroid gland on the anterior trachea of the neck. In papillary carcinoma, small, multifocal. In follicular carcinoma, moderate size, nodular. In medullary carcinoma, moderate size. In anaplastic carcinoma, invasive growth. Feature number 8 is pathognomonic microscopy, which means the appearance of cut section of the thyroid gland by H and E. In papillary carcinoma, nuclear features, papillary pattern. In follicular carcinoma, vascular and capsular invasion. In medullary carcinoma, solid nests, amyloid stroma. In anaplastic carcinoma, undifferentiated, spindle-shaped, giant cells. Feature number 9 is regional metastases, which means cancer has spread to nearby lymph nodes, tissues, or organs. In, in papillary carcinoma, medullary carcinoma and anaplastic carcinoma are common, except in follicular carcinoma is become rare. Feature number 10 is 10-year survival, which means ratio of the proportion of people who are still alive at 10 years after diagnosis of their cancer. In papillary carcinoma, 80 to 95 percent. In follicular carcinoma, 50 to 70 percent. In medullary carcinoma, minus 60 to 70 percent. In anaplastic carcinoma, 5 to 10 percent, median survival about two months. Thank you.